that for five dollars per person or half an hour is a good deal, I think. Yeah. I like deep tub. Yeah, it's deep. Yeah. Look that. I am standing and it's in my chest, the water. This is cedar, I think. Really? Yeah, that's my favorite part. It's, I think it's concrete. No, it's cedar the whole way. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Cedar top. Super cool. Two thumbs up, baby. All right, we just got done with a half hour soak at Indian Springs in Truth or Consequences, which is right there. We're gonna walk across the street and go to La Paloma Hot Springs for and do a half hour there. Let's go to the office. This one. This is not a big like Indian dog. Right. No. Three feet. Yeah. So they said this is 111 degrees. It's definitely hotter than the last one we were in. Yeah. But once you get in, it feels pretty good. I like this dog. I like this. Just got done with La Paloma bathhouse, hot springs, and I feel amazing. That place is legit. They absolutely do it right. And I think it was really good to go to Indian Springs first because that water was great. I'm gonna go back to Indian, but, and it's, it's $2 cheaper for a half hour. I mean, it's so cheap, you can do it a soak for five dollars a half hour is enough and it's pretty sweet absolutely recommend both places now there's this artesian mineral bath but it looks like they're closed so we're gonna there's there's hot springs all over this place bathhouses all over this place so we're going to keep exploring we got uh we're gonna go to river bend in a couple hours and uh, spend two hours there because they got different tubs and a sauna and it's on the Rio Grande and apparently you can see the sunset from there. So stay tuned. So we just had some coffee at Ingo's and Truth or Consequences. We need to get a room. We were told to come here to the Pelican Spa where you get a $55 room and you get to soak, right? Yeah, we have a kitchen. So we're going in. We're gonna see what's up. All right, guys, just got our room at the Pink Pelican. You can see why they call it the Pink Pelican. Here's our room. We 
would get a little, like, I guess you would call this a sunroom, living room type of thing. Queen bed, heater on, it's gonna get cold tonight. Little fridge, microwave, kitchenette. I don't know what's down here, not in storage. Uh, and then uh, the bathroom. Shower, toilet. Coffee. Some coffee. Mm, nice. Now we're gonna head over, uh, bring our stuff in, and then soak. We'll show you the tubs, pink pelican. walking over to the spa. They got five hot tubs with spring water. And uh, it's gonna give us a tour. Do you remember his name? Uh, no. I don't remember either. Here it is, Pelican Spa. All hot springs. Yeah, this is the yoga studio. Ah, we'll check that out, huh? Yeah. yeah all right. You gonna fill the tub? Yeah. tub at the Pelican Spa and true the consequences. Alright guys, just got done soaking at Pelican Spa in Truth or Consequences and I feel amazing. That yeah, water this is good. Yeah third one of the day, that water was hot. Measured at like 107 degrees Fahrenheit, 108. That was our third soak of the day. Yeah. <laughs> and that was just, woo. Day two at Pelican Hot Springs bathhouse. And uh, we just got done with a morning soak. Feel amazing, we got three more hot spring resorts to hit today so we're keeping this one short next stop coffee all right guys so we're waiting for the coffee shops to open up so we just decided to grab some breakfast and it looks like we're gonna do the grapevine bistro over there right across from the coffee shop 413 is my birthday 413 grapevine bistro we're gonna go eat at her birthday spot. <laughs> Stay tuned. What are you gonna get? I have to read this. Here, this is a perfect example of how the fisheye works. Okay. See? You would think it's just showing our chest, but I bet it's gonna get our head. So, you know what you're gonna get? I will take a breakfast salad. Um, you? Huevo ranch cheros. Yep. Good coffee. Good morning. Good morning. Cheers. What do you have? Salad. Just the breakfast salad? Yeah, with that nice bacon, the dessert. 
I had tomato sauce with cilantro, yeah. avocado, yogurt sauce. Oh my god, that bacon. That yeah. And then the black bean patty. Yeah. Good, right? Mm -hmm. Huevos rancheros. Alright, we're at Blackstone Hot Springs bathhouse and we're gonna go in and see if we can get a private tub. What's up guys, just got done with Blackstone Hot Springs. We had the wet room, which has the waterfall steam room, all spring water, and that was amazing. Um, just another home run here in Truth or Consequences. So I highly recommend you come check out Blackstone Hot Springs in Truth or Consequences. Is that right? Yeah. All right guys, we just got to Riverbend. We're about to do an hour here before we go to our Airbnb. And this will be pretty much our last stop uh, in Truth or Consequences, so stay tuned. All right, guys, just got to our Airbnb in Truth or Consequences. We're literally steps away from the hot springs we were just at. In our Airbnb, I love that window. The sun is shining through it. This bed was okay, warm. Sheets were soft. Making tea and coffee? Yeah. This is nice. Old yeah. kitchen, gas kitchen. We're in Santa Fe. Oh my Continue God. Continue on West San Mateo Road for a half mile. We're behind a car with one, one, one. Yeah, one, one, one. Wow, Bayo. <laughs> What's up, guys? We're in Santa Fe, and we just got accepted uh, by a farmer in the Gila to come work on his farm for five days. So we're about to finish our lunch. I've got a little wrap here with pear and walnut. She's got a bagel. With honey, walnuts, and cream cheese. And uh, we're about to make our way. It's a six-hour drive. We're going to camp in the Gila National Forest. No, no. 
at the Gila Hot Springs. It's a campsite in the Gila National Forest. So more adventure to come. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching.